Hi Tubies, male, female or otherwise of every shape, ability and gender. Welcome to another painting tutorial. Today we are painting a power weapon. And uh, well, as you can see, I have uh, already primed this uh, power weapon and uh, I've done so in a very dark blue tone here uh, and I have uh, outlined where I want to have the highlights. This is just uh, the basic step to have a uh, well, groundwork uh, to work on because um, we are wet blending this blade and uh, wet blending tends to uh, be a lot of uh, transparent paint uh, because we are uh, using quite diluted paint and it is good to have a, a base where the translucent paint uh, can uh, well grab on some additional color to uh, sell the transition. So, uh, what colors are we using? Uh, we are using here deep blue from uh, scale color, but you can use every other dark, every other dark color. Then we use a very very light blue. This is a mixture out of uh, white and very tiny amount of blue, <coughs> and uh, obviously a little bit of white. So, <coughs> give the colors a good shake, and then uh, we will apply the paint to my wet palette here <clears throat> so this is the dark color we will add drop of water to it <clears throat> then we need a bright blue This is already quite diluted, this paint, as you can see. <clears throat> so, and with these two colors, we are going to work. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> first uh, we will establish a first uh, wet coat of the dark paint. Let's say uh, we want to make this transition here first, this here. Then uh, I apply here a little bit of the dark paint along this line. Then I take uh, the bright color, put it there. <coughs> And then I'm doing a wiggly motion like that to uh, transition the colors. Wipe off a little bit of the excess. Get a little bit more white on the tip. And we're doing this again, back and forth until we don't see a transition anymore. Sometimes you have to do the I have to do this in several steps. Now I'm going back to the dark color here. <clears throat> Wiping off paint from the brush when I have too much. And I'm pretty much mixing the color directly on the blade here. You're basically doing this uh, back and forth until you are satisfied with the result. See? <clears throat> Just having a damp brush right now. And uh, <clears throat> we can let that uh, part dry now. And now 
we do the same thing on the opposite side. Dark color first, <coughs> then the bright color. And we are wiggling our way down like this. And we're doing this back and forth until we are satisfied. Okay, I think that's uh, okay for now. And uh, well, we are doing this uh, with the entire blade. Sometimes you just have to leave that to dry and uh, make another coat uh, with a very diluted paint. And uh, you can go uh, with the blending as hard or as uh, soft as you want. But I think uh, overall this is a, a relatively good uh, transition overall. Um, with practice uh, makes perfect definitely so and uh, to sell this uh, non-metallic metal uh, effect <clears throat> even more we uh, can grab our brush here with a bright color make it a uh, nice blade shaped and flat and with that uh, we can make a nice edge highlight here and Well, the edge of the blade, and maybe here in the middle, very gently. And that way we get a nice edge highlight. Yeah, <clears throat> I hope you uh, like this short little tutorial how to uh, wet blend your uh, your power weapons and we see us in the next video. Alexandra, bye!